That was nice work. Keep it up, old pal. Fine. Get this and get it right. And don't forget you're making talking pictures. Now, in this sequence, you're supposed to be seeing Mamie Holmes. You understand that, Mamie? Oh, yes, I understand it perfectly. Now, listen, when his back is turned, you sneak up behind him from the lamppost, and you say, at last, I have you, Jack Dalton. You understand? Perfectly. You're supposed to shoot him, not her. I see. Well, now then, if it's all clear, we'll shoot the picture. Come on, let's go. Everybody ready? Hammer! Oh, I had a lovely time. Do Very come nice to see me again. Well, I hate to say goodbye to you, honey, but but uh, I, I must really go. Goodbye, goodbye dear. Goodbye. At last, Jack Dawson. I swore I'd get you. Now I've got you. This is where you say your prayers. Oh, for heaven's sake. Heaven's sake, that's nothing like it. Nothing like it. What? Well, well, why don't you need to hold it? Wait a minute. And you, why didn't you kiss him properly? Because he's been eating garlic. Uh. <laughs> hold your nose. You won't notice it. Now get this. You shoot the gun so he can drop dead. Say, why don't you choke him to death? It'll be much nicer. Say, where is that wise cracking bozo? He's not here yet. He'll be here in a minute. Come on, come on. Let's get some action into this picture. Come on, are you ready to shoot? Let's go. Sure, come on. Yes, come on. All right, come on. Uh, well, uh, honey, uh, I, I hate to say goodbye, uh, but, but I must. Goodbye, dear. Goodbye, goodbye. goodbye. Now, yes, Jack Dawson. I've been waiting for you for a long time, and I finally got you. Wait a minute. Oh. This is where you're going to say your prayers. I can't stand this any longer. You've ruined the picture. This boy's 50 feet of film. What's the matter with you? Well, get you it big fathead. You. You're fired. Now. Come on, call lunch until I can get a hold of another leading man. Come on, maybe we'll go to lunch. How will I do? Hey, you're prick. Pardon me, pardon me. Author, I write my own story and I play my own lead. And uh, pardon me, I want you to know that my mother and father are both actors. Yes, how oh, interesting. Yes, the uh, fact of the matter is that uh, I was born on the stage. I remember very well it was during a matinee. Oh, and, how uh, romantic. Yes, it's quite just delirious, that. And, uh... Would you, uh, like to hear my last story? No. Very well, then you shall hear it. Now then, uh, just uh, visualize it. It's late in the sunny south. Ah, uh, it's springtime. There's a sound that I am playing the part of the school teacher. The birds are whistling and singing among the tivies. And my little children, my little pupils are waiting for me. As I'm walking down the aisle, Tapping each and every one on their smiling brows, we fade out. Oh, my 
skills and did good. Now, uh, sing our little closing song before we scamper home. Just a minute. Let's get the right tune. Pretty. Ready? Go. Now then, all my little babies, can't go right home. Be very careful. Run right along. Comes in. Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Tell her to him over there. He's got nothing to worry about. The fellow over there? Yes. All right. I'll be back in a minute. And that's when the girl whom I love drives up with my hated drive. Good afternoon, Miss Sally. And how is the South's most beautiful girl? Oh, Mr. Brainerd, you're always saying such nice things. Captain Porter here has just returned from down Louisiana, and we are giving a party in New Donna tomorrow evening. I'd like very much for you to come over. Why, it'll be a pleasure, Miss Sally. Well, I'll be there. Yes, I will, a bowl, a bon boy. I mean, uh, all the dogs. All the dogs. I will, bye. I'll be there. I'll wait for you. See ya. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Which one is the pig? The one with the tail. Say, he wants to hear the rest of it. He does? Mm -hmm. All right. He shall hear it right away. 